Yo, what's going on guys, it's your boy Coffee Jet 70 and today I'm going to use guys a tutorial of how to set up your own streams. Now, a lot of my streams I get questions saying, how do you stream like this? How do you have alerts saying someone subscribed or donations and stuff like that? Now, first thing you want to do is, you're going to need a computer, obviously you're going to need your capture device, uh, whatever you use. For me, it's an Elgato. I know a lot of people use some Razer equipment like for game captures or whatever they want, but for me it's an Elgato. And basically, you want to head over to Streamlabs first on your laptop or desktop, whatever. And over here, you're going to need to log into your account. By login, you'll add your YouTube account, your Twitch account, or whatever you're using. Now, the only thing that I think Streamlabs accepts is YouTube, Twitch, Beam, which is basically Mixer now. Um, I think Facebook, but I'm not 100% sure on that one. But uh, once you're logged in anyway, you'll go to, uh, you want to actually go to your donation settings and you would want to connect your PayPal or Bitcoin account, whatever you use on that. So when you get donations, it goes into there and you would add that in donation settings. But when you finish that and you want to set up alerts and shit, you want to head over to alert box. Now, as you can see, this whole time there's been most of this black box over here that's been covering my widget URL because if people see that, they can basically do shit to my stuff so that's why I've been having that black the whole time um, but you'd want to copy it so you want to highlight it and copy the thing that my uh, you'd want to show it then copy it and highlight the thing that there's a black box over on my screen then head over to your OBS now if you're not using OBS and you're using XSplit or something this will still work the same it's basically the same thing so um you want sorry about that guys in the background my bad um you want to press add and you yeah, fucking yeah. all right guys i'm back sorry about that and as i was saying you want to go here you want to go add and you want to choose video capture device now once you click on that i'm just going to name mine elgato in this case so i'm typing to uh elgato and go elgato game capture hd well for you it'll be called something else and if it's a small picture like this, you want to make sure you go over here at custom. If it's not like this, change resolution over to 1920 1080 and press OK. Now don't fidget with that too fast because if you do, it, it will like crash OBS. Now if yours doesn't get set out like this and it's a little mixy, you just need to resize it into the actual box like that. Because if it gets set up like this, how it is like now, you just want to resize it into the box and you'll be good to go. And now you got your capture card device in. You're going to press add again and browser source. Now, if it's not browser source for you, it'll be CLL, uh, CLRL, um, uh, CLR browser, my bad. And for this, we're going to need alerts. Now, you want to get rid of this because this is going to be shown OBS, and you want to put in the link that you had. As you can see, mine's blacked out. And, ooh, you boy, temper. Um, you want to put it where you want. So, let's just say you want to sub here, put it there. Now you go back over here, let's say test subscriber. Let's try that. There we go. Corp 27 just subscribe. Cool. Now as you can see there's a double echo there, that's my bad because it goes through all of this stuff. Um so yeah, that's how you set up your alerts there. Now if you guys want to go more technical and set up a chat box, chat box option is over here. But if you guys want labels and shit for recent donations, you can do stream labels also. But uh, that's how you set up your alerts and all. And then you continue streaming. Someone subs, it will automatically go off like that. And we'll just go sub. And same with donations. Someone donates. Donated $66. That, that was really spam. This, this, this is a test, test donation. donation. Dollar. See, I got my voice on. So we'll test that. Obviously, $69. This, this, this is, is a test, test donation. donation. Dollar. Why not? So yeah, now you've done that, and that's that's what you want to do if you just want to stop streaming. Now, just before I end it, I'd like to let you know that the recommended upload speed definitely for streaming, you want to at least have like four upload Mbps and over, so you can actually maybe get some high quality streams. If you've only got three Mbps, you can at least stream most probably max 720p, just if you're lucky, you'll be laggy though. But you want to at least maybe have 5 MPS, MBPS upload if you're like someone not too good internet so you can actually get 1080p streamer or 720p 60fps. For some reason my upload speed is not the best but my download is really good so I had to stream 720p 60fps. I can just do 1080 but I like to have the 60fps in it. Now I'm going to leave in the uh, description recommended MB MBPS for each um, quality so you guys can sort that out for you. Otherwise I love you all and I'll see you in the next one.